Hello Disney Pixar fans and welcome to the Nerdy Naturalist YouTube channel. I'm ecologist Dr. Ped Danishkar and today let's fact check Finding Nemo. When we examined Finding Nemo, we found more than 30 inaccuracies throughout the film. I'm going to share with you five that occur in the first 10 minutes. Marlin should be female. Clownfish exhibit sequential hermaphrodism, which means when the dominant female dies, the dominant male should become female. Marlin stayed the father the whole time. Interestingly, all clownfish are born male. They only change when a female is needed. Barracudas do not eat fish eggs. All of Nemo's unhatched siblings were eaten by a barracuda. Barracudas don't eat fish eggs and rarely eat clownfish. Barracudas feed on fishes such as jacks, grunts, groupers, snappers, small tunas, mullets, herrings, and anchovies. The attack that starts the movie is unlikely. Male clownfish protect the eggs. When the barracuda arrived, Nemo's mother Coral swam down to protect the eggs. In real life, female clownfish defend against predators while males protect the eggs. Nemo should not have been born. There is a visible scar on Nemo's egg showing that he was injured. Male clownfish usually eat the eggs that are infertile, damaged, growing fungus, or are unviable. Nemo should not be with Marlin. Larval clownfish do not usually stay with their parents. Instead, they are often carried away to other parts of the reef. Despite this, clownfish are social animals that do live in groups, usually consisting of one dominant female, one dominant male, and a group of smaller males. If you want more Nemo inaccuracies, leave a comment below. Thanks for joining us as we break down your favorite nerdy media. If you enjoyed this content, please click like. And if you want to continue to discover the truth in the imaginary world with us, the Nerdy Naturalists, please subscribe.